In this video, we will learn how to make D flip flop within the Proteus. D flip flop is just like an RS flip flop, except with the fact that D flip flop is having an additional inverter between set and reset inputs or pins. D, flip, D in the word D in D flip flop is actually for delay. This delay used to occur between input and output is our D flip flop is not going to change its output until the rising edge of the clock comes. So, in order to make D flip flop, first we will select DTFF and just paste here that is DTFF. Then logic toggle on D input then you must have to add one clock D clock here okay and frequency must be 0 0.5 okay. in order to check the output there must be two logic probes so when we will give zero on d q will be zero when we will give one on d q will be one but when it will change the state until the clock used to give a rising edge that is if the clock is going from 0 to 1 in that condition or in that time or after that time or in that time you can say it will change its output so let's run the circuit now you can see that when we give D Q will be the same state as D, but there is some bit time delay. Why this is so? Because the state of D will be given to Q until the clock is giving its rise, its rising edge. You can also see there is Q dash. When Q is 0, Q dash will be its complement. So when Q is 1, Q dash is 0. And when Q is 0, Q dash is 1. Again, see. When D is 1, Q is 1 and Q dash is 0. When D is 0, Q is 0 and Q dash is 1. It's enough for today. Uh, now, after this, you can make your own D flip flop within the Proteus. Thanks for watching.